Hey there, it's Susan from Made For You by Susan, and I have another shop update today. I'm going to show you the stuffed animals that I make. Uh, these are not all of them. The majority I've given to my nieces, so I can always take special orders if you're looking for something specific. I have kind of an obsession with collecting stuffed animals, and as soon as I found out that I could knit them, I was all there, <laughs> all in. Even though I have to sew, because the way that I construct them, I still love to do it, even though I don't like sewing. But the end product is pretty fun. So the first thing I want to show you are the little dinosaurs that I make. These are the Stegosauruses. They have um, these cute little heads like Stegosauruses have. Uh, one thing about the eyes, I always use safety eyes in all of my knitting but because this is a knitted fabric and it has holes in it, it's still fairly easy to pull these out, um, especially if you're a kid. And I wouldn't want anyone to swallow them. So these are not good for babies or small children. So he has cute little back plates that are a different color. And then I did his feet in the same color. And he has knobby little feet. This one over here. Um, has slightly bigger eyes, if you can see that, and is a dark purple, and then I did the feet and the plating in the same color. Again, I can always do this in whatever color that you're looking for. The second thing I want to show you today is this kitten, and it's pretty cute. It has almost like a teddy bear face, and again, the whiskers pull out rather easily, so no babies or small children. Floppy little cute arms, and the legs are sewed together so they don't really move. But the tail is really long, and it's really cute. And like I said before, um, these can sit on a desk or on a shelf and just be decorative items. And that's where a lot of mine sit. So the last thing I made is this bee. I just completed it pretty recently, and... I think he's pretty cute. His name is Buzz. He has these really adorable floppy antennae, a great smile, um, wings that are pretty floppy, and then these great legs and feet. Doesn't have a tail because I couldn't figure out how to do a stinger, and I wanted to make him happy, so he's not going to sting anyone anyway. So, again, this is my update for my stuffed animals, and my shop is made for you by Susan, and I'm Susan, and I hope you liked it, and have a great day.